Hey, how's it going? It's Warren again, Sunday Gamer at YouTube or SundayGamer.com. Here to tell you a little bit about a new chessboard that I procured. This happened after just started getting back into the game a little bit, playing with one of my neighbors, and this is my old set right here. It's a nice little book style set, you know, folds up in the middle, pieces go inside. Um, nice wooden chess men, kind of elegant, beautiful. I've had it for years and years and years. But the only problem is this board is very small. Um, take a peek at the old king here. It's incredibly tiny. I can hold it in my hand very well, conceal it, do some sleight of hand maybe, you know, some gorilla chess. But when you're playing with this little guy here, and your flag's about to fall, and you're like, holy crap, man, oh no, what am I gonna, oh, damn it all. You know, it's, it's just too cramped. Can't play like that. So, I went on to wholesalechess.com. I don't work for them, I just found this board and decided to go for it. And if anyone's looking for it, wants a little uh, heads up on what they're gonna get, this is it right here. I can slide my whole board next to it for a sense of scale. This new one can eat the old one for dinner. It's fantastic. I'm very satisfied with it so far. The chess men are, they're plastic, but they're very high quality molding. You can barely even see the parting lines on them. Uh, they're weighted as well, so if I'm striking forward with my rook here, it's like biggity bam. And, you know, I can, I can tip it. I can, you know, if I brush it with my hand, it's probably going to stay right where it needs to go. And that gives, it just feels really nice. If you're just like, hurrah! Really beautiful. Um, another note on the men, they're touting a four and a half or four and an eighth inch king, which compared to the old version, yeah, that king is very, very stout. It's like, yeah, I'm gonna eat you for dinner. Roar. And looking at a size, a sense of scale again here, uh, four square on the old board is approximately the size of one square on the new one. And there's still a lot of room to work with here. I mean, you can move your pieces around very easily. No more knocking over chessmen unintentionally, especially when things start getting heated and heavy. On top of that, your board comes with an additional queen per side, which is always good if you're doing some beasting with the pass pawns. Uh, on top of that, a couple of things I noticed about this that were kind of sketchy. If you look at this board, the board itself is a mouse pad type of material, rubber on the bottom with this fabric on top. It's a little bit frayed at spots on the corners, and I think it may be something that I'll have to remedy somehow. Unsure as to how I'm going to do that yet. The queens as well came with a lot of a uh, lot of flashing, a lot of sharp points here around these little peaks. I took some emery cloth and a burr knife from work, cut them down, kind of sanded them down. So if you do go for this set, you're going to want to go at that with a nail file right away because it's going to be really easy to wound yourself or for your opponent to wound himself or herself on those, especially when things get heated. You don't want to be reaching down for your queen and stab yourself and bleed all over your nice new chess board. Wholesale Chess does offer a, uh, a slightly cheaper set. It doesn't have the mouse pad material, it just has a flat vinyl board, but I went for the mouse pad because it just looked nice. And I was in New York uh, about six or seven months ago and saw some guys playing on a board very similar to this and it just looked like something I had to eventually have and I went for it. On top of that, let's see. Um, when you're done playing, for easy transportation, let's grab a couple of these chessmen, walk over here. It does come with a nice handy case. Nice handy carrying case. Your board rolls up and secured on the top here with those two elastic straps. You got two pouches over here for your chessmen to fit nicely into. And then you've got a central pocket here for your clock. On the other side you've got your little you know, hold it for some pens, for a card, I don't know, maybe I just kicked your ass at chess, here's my business card. Um, and there's also a pouch down here for carrying various items, such as Jeremy Silman's How to Reassess Your Chess. Fantastic book, there's some deep stuff there. So that's what I've got right now. So I hope this helps you if you're looking at picking up a new set and you've kind of had to glance at this piece from a wholesale chess here. 
So that's about it. Hopefully that uh, gives you a little bit more of an idea of what you're getting. The website only has a couple of pictures, but there it is in all of its glory, and I'm having a lot of fun with it. So thanks for watching. Hope that helped.